When working on reeds, the first thing to check is to make sure that the back of the reed is flat. A warped reed is the most common occurrence for a reed to fail to perform satisfactorily. When the reed back is warped, like this piece of paper, it prevents the reed from vibrating efficiently. When the reed is flat against the mouthpiece, the stress is relieved from the reed, allowing the reed to vibrate freely. The reed surfacer can help ensure that the back of the reed is flat. I prefer to work on my reeds after they've been broken in by wetting and drying each day for about a week. First, check the back of the reed for flatness. Wet the reed by dipping it in a glass of water and lightly placing it on the flat surface such as the Muncie reed plaque. Look for an air space where the reed is not touching the plaque. This indicates the back is warped. If the back of the reed is warped, dry off the water from the reed and place the reed on the reed surfacer with the vamp extending off the sanding area. Place three fingers on the bark of the reed, applying even pressure and sanding in a circular motion. Prevent the vamp of the reed from entering the sanding area. Wet the reed again and place the reed on the reed plaque once again to check for flatness. Continue this process until the reed back is flat. 